I attach my BMK GPS system on my oldest P30 model. This is the airborne part. It weighs one and a half grams plus the weight of a 40 milliamp battery. This is the receiver and here is the information you get from every flight like the altitude and the climb, maximum sync and the total flight time. I was using less than full turns on my P30 and it was a cold day. It's at 32 degrees Fahrenheit but the wind is really low. Now on the receiver you see the display in real time of the altitude of the model but uh, I didn't do a very good job of picking up on that. Like other systems it uses barometric pressure to determine the altitude and it can be off some but it definitely gives you an idea of the model is going up or if it's coming down and you're going to know if you're in a thermal. The maximum altitude that I got to was about 25 meters and the maximum distance I got out was about 126 meters. The wind was uh, less than two miles an hour. So I was amazed that it drifted that far. You would think you could uh, find an airplane this size in this field pretty easily, but with the uh, light brown corn stalks and a yellow and orange airplane, finding it without this would have been tricky. So here you see I'm walking to it, and you can see the distance counts down, the arrows pointing towards the plane, and there it is. Now I think it showed about five meters when I was real close, but on this flight, it showed just one meter when it was probably just one meter away. So the accuracy kind of changes a little bit, but it's usually pretty good. Well, on this last flight, it got out quite a ways and I lost it in the camera, but uh, it came down by DT pop-off wing, and here it is. So I'm having a great time learning this system, and I think it has lots of possibilities.